What's a low billy, you ask? Well, on this week's Spotlight Music Series, you're going to meet one. Let's welcome Ron Gill, guitarist and vocalist for blues band The Low Billies. It's good to have you with us. Good to be here. So what is a low billy? Uh, a low billy, in our case, is somebody that plays blues music in the low country. And you would think that blues music is pervasive in the South. You would, and I, I was kind of surprised. While we have a, a pretty good community of, uh, of blues players here, um, I, I was kind of surprised that there's not more. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I've wandered around a little bit between here and Atlanta and, and Asheville. And, but you're and bringing whatnot. it, you're making it more popular, you're making it more in the, I hope in the so. public view. So you, though, have performed all over the country performing blues, and this Quite has always kind of been your genre as a musician, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah. I, I gravitated toward that kind of early on, probably. You know, I, was, I was in my late teens, probably. Uh, what I drew mean, you to it? What did you like so much about it? Uh, I think it's mostly it, it's that comes from the heart, you know. Um, it's not just kind of manufactured music mm -hmm. uh, business sort of stuff. Oh, sure. Um, and, and all those players that that originated the form, uh, you know, that that was their life, mm -hmm. and they let you know it. Yeah, yeah, certainly. So you kind of let your heart pour out yeah. into the music. And yeah. do you have any influences that have been particular? particularly oh strong boy. in your life? Um, you know, I've, there there's so many. Uh, um, I, I find that, that, you know, depending on the day, it's it's guys like uh, uh, um, the the Kings, you know, B.B. and Freddie and, and uh, Albert, uh, you know, it could be uh, uh, more contemporary guys like uh, uh, Little Charlie. Um, Do you, you know, think so that these musicians that they, they had the blues and this is why they performed the blues and and do you find that you it resonates with you have you had some well i think those original that, you uh, that that first generation guys back in the 30s and maybe even before that they absolutely lived the blues there's yeah. no two ways about it would you say that you've also lived the blues uh no nah, <laughs> nah. I, I, I haven't lived too much blues uh, i mean i just love the genre love yeah. the music love performing it uh, and what i kind of like about it also is that you're kind of expected to pay homage to all of those old blues players so you get to play their music and and it's it's not just kind of thought of as that eh, you're playing cover tunes you know sure. it's like it's like no no you're really just kind of paying paying respect to to those guys that originated it way back when absolutely and their instrument too, because of the way they play the guitar, the way they play the drums, it's certainly very specific. Yes. And you can just tell there's a lot of love put yeah. into that. Now, you've also, um, you are part of the Low Country Blues Jam. You're a member with this organization. Right. What right. is this? Uh, well, it's called the uh, Low Country Blues Connection, and uh, it is the affiliate of the Blues Foundation here in Charleston. And uh, we have a weekly jam. It's it's every Sunday from 5 to 9. It's over at the pub on 61 right now. Yeah. Um, and so we invite everybody to come out there and, and jam or, or just enjoy the music. But uh, uh, that, that affiliation uh, with the, the Blues Foundation, they're in Memphis and they hold a, uh, a, a showcase every year called the International Blues Challenge. And so we get to send uh, two groups. One would be either a solo or a duo, and then the other would be uh, anywhere, a band, three pieces or more. Oh, wow. And so we help them financially. We hold a, 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 a showcase and then That's are great. able to pick those acts to go to Memphis. Well, you're, you're helping to carry that torch, which I think is fantastic. So not only the Blues Jam, you can find this man, but you can also go to Accent on Wall. Wine. That's Fridays, December 9th and 30th. And you can also find them at the Palmetto Brewery. So make sure you head out there. You're going to be performing something for us today, aren't you? Yes, we are. What is it called? Uh, it's called On Terra Firma in Irma. <laughs> Terra Firma I was in Irma. sitting on my porch over in West Ashley when I first moved here and Irma was coming through. And yeah. it's like, oh, I should write a song about Hurricane now. <laughs> I love that. I love that. Maybe On Terra Firma in Irma, in Irmo, right? I mean, there's a, <laughs> yeah. Irmo, South Carolina. So I mean, you Could just be. keep going. Keep going. Yeah. And you can also see this face on the Righteous Gemstone, so make sure you look out for him, too. <laughs> Thank you so much. Well, I can't wait to hear the song. We'll do that after the break.